Clayton, today we build a fixture table. Having fun yet? No. No. So, Clayton and I did a terrible job filming this. We basically got the table cut. I've been working on getting this thing together for like a couple of years, to be honest. And Clayton kind of took on the task a couple months ago. And finally, we got it cut out. So the first steps were basically, it's just a slot, uh, key and slot kind of set up. So we just pieced it all together, which literally took minutes to do. And then the time consuming part was getting it all level as much as we could. So we were gonna use an actual level, but we decided to use the straight, the machine straight edge I had to try to get it as precise as we possibly could. And you use that for checking like straightness of blocks and heads. So yes, it's yeah. very precise. Precise. So um, we just did uh, a little bit at a time, welding, tacking, moving along and starting from the center and going to the outside to again try to keep the table as flat as we could and for those that don't know what this thing is it's a fixture table and it's designed to basically help replicate parts and it's really good for welding and clamping stuff too but it's if we can easily replicate stuff it's going to make production of custom items a lot simpler for us that and just for the same for the pure fact like you said if you're building a downpipe being able to clamp weird things in place while you're welding because yeah, if like anybody's it, ever welded stuff together that you know you need a buddy to help hold stuff or whatever it's it's kind of a pain like so building, with this is yeah. you can set up tooling to actually hold it to how you need so not even for replicating but even just for ease of welding and clamping whatever you need to the spot you need yeah like building fuel cells and a big open or a big box for example you got to try to hold all the sides together it's super easy with this also there's a lot of times when i got to take an exhaust off of a car and it's obviously huge because it's all assembled um, if we're modifying a stock exhaust this can just be laid on the table clamped down without having to worry about it flying off the edge yep. uh, definitely going to make that part of it way way easier so Let's get to some more of the time lapse and some of the conversation we have throughout building this thing. A little more work than what you thought? No, well, I knew it was going to be a lot of work. You said it would be done tonight. It's a lot of hours still left till tonight. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We got a lot more to do here yet. Okay, so here's what we're working with. Just constantly moving the straight edge, clamping a million clamps, wedging the plate, doing everything to get the top of the plate straight, um, which is taking a very long time. At this point, to do the top, I got this side done, and this side over here. Uh, with Clayton's help, the last couple of nights, we probably have and then a little bit of time I had last night. We probably have four hours maybe into this so far. Um, so it's a lot of work to get this thing straight, but I'll never probably build one of these again unless I'm adding onto it. So I wanna make sure this is right. So we'll probably put the camera back down for some time lapse, but yeah. Ratchet straps, clamps, screwdrivers, vice grips, everything you can think of to get it straight. Okay, so after another, I don't know, hour and a half, two hours of leveling, welding, leveling, welding, and repeating, I'm on the very last corner, and it's still need, I still need to go back through and weld a whole bunch of stuff 
just to make it secure and then grind them all down a little bit. Uh, but this will be enough to get it up and get the legs on it, like flip it over, weld underneath, get the legs on it and stuff. So anyways, last corner and uh, moving on to other stuff. So, back at this again today. You're gonna film yourself first? No, we're gonna film you. Doing work. So we're gonna start tackling the legs. Um, we got the plates for the legs welded in. The legs are all cut. We're just going to, gotta drill some plates for the bottom of the legs and get the casters and everything set up. So we'll probably just do a little bit more time lapse as we finally get the welding done and start assembling it hopefully the footage isn't uh totally mess because we somebody were... put the camera too close to the welding i don't know if it was me or you the other day no, no, that's, that's i know someone someone did it yeah so the gopro took some major abuse on the lens from the weld splatter uh but things are getting serious now we're getting the legs on it clayton's welding up the bottom of the bases and we're well we still got to do the pieces going across but we're getting closer. This is so much work to get this done. Yeah. Clayton, what do you think? It's a lot of welding. A lot of work, period. Yeah. Okay, back to it. Okay. We're getting somewhere. Legs are welded on. And how many, how many more hours have we been at this? I got here at what? Quarter after one? Let's say 1.30 because you came. Yeah. I was already here at quarter after. Yeah, so it's a real probably interesting uh, view right now. I just did that one leg. Yeah, it's a good leg. It's, it's a good, good leg. <laughs> um, yeah, so what is it, 4.30 now? So 4.50. Three yeah. hours? Yeah, three hours of just getting to this. And this is two people basically going steady at it well, because been going steady you've been kind of just yeah getting all the stuff to make it work oh yeah trips trips to kent yeah we had to make a couple trips to kent and uh for some parts but we're getting closer to flipping this over finally anyways back to it Okay, so far died while we're doing some time lapse. Clayton is uh, putting in work today. So the legs are pretty much done. We're about to put the casters on and try flipping the table over with the cherry picker because right now it probably weighs, if I had to guess, uh, 600 pounds, maybe more. I don't know, it's definitely heavy. The two of us are definitely not moving this on our own. Um, but there she is. So let's get it flipped over. We still got bench or like a shelf. shelf to do underneath here and another shelf to hold a bunch of stuff. But once we get it flipped over, uh, our, what's the word, what's the word? Fruit, uh, what's the, what do you say there? Fruits of your labor. Long, yeah, fruits of your labor. We'll be able to see what we got here. <laughs> so, yeah, it's got the yeah, something like that. Yeah, something like that. Okay, let's flip it over. We'll do time lapse of us uh, struggling. spending struggling trying to flip this thing over. How's all this footage going to be at the GoPro? I don't know. I'm just too lazy to we're take wing, it camera. We're winging this one. Yeah, we're big time. It. So the thing's all finished. Um, obviously, oh. you kind of seen it at the beginning of it, and yes, I guess it's not completely finished. No. We still have to go over and grind the tops of the welds off. We're probably going to weld in some of these keys a little bit better. Also, 
We're gonna make a shelf on the bottom. Uh, so there's a few more pieces that need to be welded in there. And I might build another uh, level of a shelf in there for just some sheet metal and stuff like that for the plasma table. Um, but yeah, so I don't know, Clayton, it's, this was a lot of work. Yeah, definitely. Like the footage we have. This is why we don't have an actual video this week or something else. Cause well, it's been all there's this. a couple of reasons. Yeah. It's a lot of it's been trying to get this done. I got a lot of other stuff to work on and this was kind of hindering, uh, some of that for one, I've wanted it for a long time. So it's, I wanted to get it done. But, Two, it's not cheap. So Two, it's not cheap. And how many hours? Yeah. It's. I don't know, you had four or five hours on it yesterday. And we had how many hours on it this week? Uh, I think three or four earlier in the week. And you had today? a couple more hours on it on Friday and then today, so. Today's another what, five hours? Five hours, yeah. And so, it's still not done. And it's still not done, but it's a lot closer it's than close. what it was on Thursday or whatever it was when we picked it up. The biggest part is trying to make it flat as possible. Yeah. And that's what took a lot of time. Well, that's yeah. more of the precise time. Like, I mean, the welding took a lot of time, but that's just, I don't mind that because it's, you're just going through laying welds, right? right it's right. the the very particularness of particularness. Try. Is yeah. that a word? Particularness? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So that's going to end it for this one. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to ask them below. We appreciate all the orders for the hats that we had recently. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. GoPro, stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. Are we gonna be fixturing stuff? Uh, I think so, yeah. We're gonna build a race car. Okay. More race cars. Okay. Full two very small race, like a go-kart. Oh, yes, yeah, so let's get into go-karting. I want to, actually. We can't afford cars. I can only afford go-karting, too. Or we have to, we'd have to stop working on cars. Go -karts fit. Oh my god, I would have a thousand go karts and none of them would run. We should die on a go kart. <laughs> we should. Probably not gonna happen because neither of us own one. Yeah. So, this is a cruel or a crude? Crude. Crude. crude tool we made just to kind of show you and test the whole thing out. We didn't design this, nothing like that. This is just a homemade tool to show you what we're doing. So, oh, do you want to show what that starts as? No. No? Okay, cool. So, no magic, just goes in here. It's sort of magic. Make some more noise. You like that? Yeah. That goes on like that, and then you just tighten this. Wedges up against itself. What, this wedges in the hole, and then this wedges on this. And then now, you cannot move that. And I'd pick the table up if I was strong enough, but. Yeah, well, a strong person could probably move that. You might need two clowns, but Dave can't move that, so. Right, so. And really, you're not cranking on anything if you're welding. Are you getting just getting a hammer. That's, that's, that's not a hammer. It is today. Okay. <laughs> so anyways, that's the theory of how this all works. So it's really easy to, you know, clamp something down at any point in the table, in the center, on the sides, anywhere. Oh, yeah. So the sides. this is just a regular, uh, I think they call these F clamps. Oh, okay. Right? Because yeah. yeah, it would be an F. Oh, yeah. Just yeah. lop the end off. Upside down F. Put a 5.8. Oh, <laughs> at the beginning, when before you cut them. <laughs> right. I thought you meant now. <laughs> no, I thought you meant now. With it, with it in there. Letters. <laughs> Learning with Clayton. <laughs> oh, another F. Oh, an upside down F. Good so that's one. a capital F. <laughs> Anyways, you get the gist. Make more noise again. Yeah, you get the gist. So back to the other footage. Go press stop recording.